Hi everybody, my name is Nick Justician. I teach virtual production at Drexel University, and this is the third video in a series. The uh, previous two videos will be linked in the description. We've been working on getting this non-standard joystick controller to uh, operate a camera lens here in Unreal Engine, and it's all happening in editor uh, through Live Link. So that is great. Um, we've got the joystick working, we've got some buttons, settings, lens settings, that's great. I want to set this red button now to start and stop the take recorder so that we can actually uh, have whoever's operating the camera operate take recorder. There's a little bit of blueprint voodoo involved, but it is really easy. So uh, let's jump right in. So uh, we already have this live link uh, virtual subject blueprint that's responding to events, right? So here are where I've been binding events to uh, respond to the button pushes and set the lens settings. What I'd like to do is add one more of these. I can double click on my target connection here and uh, get another pin and I'll copy this key down bind event and we'll connect the target and we'll connect the execution and this uh, this red button is button four so we'll go ahead and choose generic USB controller button four so we're in good shape here we can delegate this and I'll just call this uh, custom event and we'll call it VCSV4 for button four Wonderful. What I'd really like to do now is uh, execute some functions that will operate our take recorder. Um, only thing is, if I right click and I type in take recorder, we can't see any node functions uh, related to the take recorder. Uh, they actually do exist. And I have to thank uh, Deepak Chetty. Uh, he was someone I worked with at Epic a bit. Uh, he's at University of Texas now. And um, he was able to point out where those nodes were. And so as a, a little shortcut, I've posted them as a code snippet here in the Epic Games uh, dev uh, community. So I will copy paste this link into description and you'll see this code snippet. And this contains a bunch of nodes uh, that operate take recorder. So to get these into our blueprint, we just hit uh, copy full snippet and we got a check mark. So that is done. And then I go back to unreal and I'll find some space in my blueprint. Let's go to full screen and control V to paste it. And there we are. So here are those nodes. Now I don't need this exact setup but we'll put these nodes to use. So here's the event that's going to fire when the red button gets pushed. I don't need this event and I don't need this event. So what I want to have happen is have our, have a branch. Basically, I want to know if the take recorder is recording or not. So I'm just going to uh, take this branch here and say, when this button is pushed, check to see if it's recording. If it is recording, then stop recording. And if it is not recording, let's just get rid of this comment here. Let's bring this down here. So, um, I just copy, moved over the is recording in the branch. And so when the button is pushed, we'll check the branch. Is it recording? If it is, stop the recording. And if it's not recording, let's go through this path. And what's going to happen here is if the take recorder panel is not open, it'll open it up. Um, at that point, it, this isn't going to run, so it'll just open the panel. Uh, if the panel is open, we'll get the uh, return value of that panel and um, it will uh, continue on and we'll, we'll uh, start recording. So I think actually we could probably just connect to this. We probably don't need this. And so let's see if this works, right? So we'll compile and that should be it. Close our blueprint. Everything should work. I'll hit my red button and off screen, my take recorder opened. So let's just move my take recorder into view here. I'll close it. And again, push the red button. There's take recorder. I will add my cine camera actor to this. And so we can uh, hit record. Three, two, one. We're recording. 
I'll push forward, I'll pull backwards. I should be zooming in and out and then I'll hit my record button and we stopped recording. So there we go. Let's uh, take a quick look at what we recorded. And sure enough, look at this. We are zooming in and out. Let's uh, show that. Perfect. So there we go. Uh, really short and easy. We've now uh, added this functionality to the uh, red button. And it is a pretty simple copy and paste of uh, just getting some blueprint nodes that aren't usually visible uh, to make them visible. These mostly can be accessed by uh, going to editor utility uh, blueprints, but um, we wanted to be able to respond to the event. So we just copy pasted out of the dev community. Hope this helps till next time. Have fun.